I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world wrapped in plastic. It's fantastic. You can brush my hair and dress me everywhere. Imagination that is your creation. Not a <clears throat> Sorry. Hello, welcome to this uh, vlog, uh, podcast about what it's like to work at a babe station with me, Kath. It's been shit actually. Um, I'm Kath. I'm. Oh, I'm just going to. I'm just going to feed the plants. I'm just quickly. This is a, a podcast um, if you ever want to know what it's like to worry <laughs> and what it's like to work at the station. Well, here I am inside this dog. <laughs> not really. I'm, I'm messing about on purpose. I'm not really inside a dog. I'm inside a, a room in Babe Station. And it's just me and hopefully you will be trans. Stevie! Sorry, I just thought about, um, I just thought about someone I know called Stevie. I'm coming up today on the, on the CAF cast. Um, it's exciting because we're going to be releasing, um, 10,000 balloons into the sky to celebrate charity. So stick around and there's going to be, uh, um, email questions and, um, a poem. And I've just um, said all of that now. Oh, well, what a week it's been. Oh, I'm sorry, that was me. I've, I've got old problems, sorry. Let me just check everything's all right down there. I'm just going to get on the bed so I can have a proper look at myself. Oh, no. My period came out black. <laughs> Must be because I'm a bit sad. Oh no. Reminds me of black milk. Mm. <coughs> Would you like to hear a joke? Mm -hmm. I thought as much. I don't know any. Sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I've got a bed case of the of the diagonals this morning I can feel my elbows sticking into my stomach I feel like such a sleepy bee please forgive me oh I think I'll just I'll just get my glass eye it's better calms me down I like to polish it Oh, dear listeners, I wish you could see me. I'm so normal. Well, what a week it's been. Um, if I had to give the week a name, I would say, mm, Vicky. I'm just going to put on some fake tan before... All those crunchy pigs start calling in, wanting to see bits of my body. <laughs> Where's the bottle? Oh, oh, here we go. Um. Oh. <laughs> Mustn't forget to do my um bum cheeks. That's better. Um, well, it's been quite a week because um. I overheard some of the babes having an argument last night and I don't think it was a bad argument but every other word was cunt 
And then one of the babes, um, babe Christina, burst open the door and came in. And the room was so full of her, and she smelt funny, like being locked in a box full of yesterday's knicker knocks and silk cut. And she was talking loudly about the EU, and she was frightened because she was from Romania, and, and she said that the world was doomed and that fire was dying out. She said that all the fire would die out in ten years' time and there'd be no more fire. Then babe Natalie came in, followed by babe Bianca and an unknown babe, and I thought the room was going to go purple and burst and they were all talking over each other. Babe Christina was still saying that fire was dying out, that there'd be no more fire in ten years, but she'd misunderstood. She'd heard someone at a barbecue saying that the fire was dying out. She thought they meant all fire. I said, Christina, there is such a thing as an eternal flame, you know. It's called love. Is this burning an eternal flame? Say my name, Kath, sunshine through the rain. Kath, a whole life so lonely, Kath, and then you come and ease the pain, Kath. I don't want to lose this feeling, Kath. Oh, I found a sweet. I'm just going to go and give it to the plant. Oh, we really need a holiday, the plants and I. I think I'll open a window, get some air. Oh look, a hedgehog with its heart hanging out. It's raining water. Mm. It's so peaceful out here. Well, here I am amongst the gnomes. And by gnomes I mean my thoughts. It's lovely out here. Would you like to hear the poem now? Oh, hang on. Oh, it'll have to wait. One of the crunchy pigs is ringing in. I'm sorry, I'll just... I'll just... I better close the window, okay? Okay. <clears throat> it won't be a second, I've just got... To... Hey there, big boy. Mmm, this is so sexual. This is so sexual. Oh, come on, chimney pops. Telephone Debbie now and tell her you're dead. That's how much I want you. What do you want me to do? What's Christmas? Describe a photo to me. Oh yeah, I've learned to think for myself and I've got so many turrets in my bra. Mm. Oh yeah, I got a biro up my bum. And I'm gonna write to you whether you're a clock, whether you're like it or not. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah. I want all you crunchy pigs to line up one by one and apologize. Is there a better way to die? Cheese and biscuits. Uh, uh, come on, Clothiers. Let's encounter mud for the first time, like two elephants together. Bye, dipshit. Sorry about that. We have to do it every 15 minutes or we get paid in buttons. I'd like to quickly do my poem now. It's called The Babes. The Babes by me, Kath. Part 1. The Babes Demands. <coughs> <coughs> no contact, said the babes. Free parking near the front said the babes our bodies are tired said the babes child friendly hours said the babes keep overheads down quoth the babes 
Light bulbs dancing, eggshell walls, love, I am hungry, the cameras of gold. And then part two of Babe's first disobedience and the fruit of that forbidden babe. The smiles of love adorn babes in humanity to babe makes countless thousands mourn. The gentle brutality of babe against babe by babe at the hand of a babe. Come on, babe. The end. <coughs> Sorry. Um, okay, just a few um, quick uh, email questions. Here we go. Hello, Kath. Why have you written it like that? Like, annoyed. Oh, Kath. Kath, who is the most famous person you've ever met? Um, DJ Dead Camel. Question two, Kath, what's the worst haircut you've ever had? This one probably, one I've got now. Kath, do you have any life advice? Um, we just try and live your life like it's a really great blog and just try and enjoy the small things like chip shop chips, Zara, getting shit off your shoe, fake flowers. But when, uh, my period came out black earlier. I don't know if you were listening, but my period came out black. And I do wonder if that's down to unfulfilled potential. The bosses don't like it when I have my period, but I think it makes me look prettier. Right, it's just time to do the balloons. Um, I just get the packet here and open them, and then we can start blowing them up. Oh, mummy! Oh no! Oh no, they're not balloons! I... Oh no, I bought plasters by mistake! Oh no, they're not! These aren't balloons! I bought hundreds of plasters by mistake! No, I bought plasters by mistake! I've bought plasters by mistake I thought they were balloons and I bought plasters I bought plasters hundreds of plasters instead of balloons by mistake you have to come out.